Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good Friday morning. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Brandon Libby. The rain has pushed out. We've been starting off the day with a little bit of fog in the north and east. That will be burning off here throughout this morning, and that will leave us with plenty of sunshine throughout today. Tonight, a few clouds may develop overhead. It's going to give us partly cloudy skies, but still a nice night overall. And actually, most of Saturday looks to be pretty nice, too. I think we have sunshine throughout the morning. Clouds will build throughout the afternoon, and then that will bring in the chance for some at least isolated showers and storms right around 4 or 5 o'clock. With an increase in temperatures and humidity, some of those storms may end up being a little bit strong. Some locally heavy rainfall, some hail, maybe some gusty winds could be possible. And we'll see the chance for rain and storms increasing throughout the evening and into the overnight time frame. I think Saturday night will be our best chance for rain overall. Uh, I think it'll be a little bit more impressive than what you see here. And we'll have chances for rain and clouds continuing into Sunday as well. For tomorrow afternoon, it's a level one out of five risk for severe weather. So widespread severe weather is not likely. The overall chance is low. But again, some storms may have some hail and wind. And the uh, main time frame for that between about 4 and 9 p.m. Honestly, the chance for rain has been dropping a little bit as you go past Saturday night. So for Sunday, chances are a little bit lower, especially Monday end up uh, could end up being a dry day, actually. So these rain totals have dropped a little bit, but I still think about a half inch to an inch and a half across the area, probably closer to a half inch in the north, more so an inch and a half there in our southern counties. Uh, and you can see the uh, the overall drop in temperatures that's on the way, a big change this weekend. Warm and humid by Saturday, then the strong cold front passes by Saturday night. It's going to drop our highs down to the upper 60s for Sunday with more of that north wind at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Same uh, thing with the dew points, pretty humid on Saturday. And then we're basically scrubbing out all humidity there for the end of the weekend and into next week. You won't even be able to feel it. And then temperatures will settle into the 70s for next week too. So it's going to feel great. Today just a little bit warm, but it's a dry heat. Humidity is dropping for today. We're going to have a west wind about 5 to 10 miles per hour. And then tonight down to about the low 60s with partly cloudy skies. Here's your city by city forecast. Again, warm on Saturday, chance for storms. And then we get a little bit cooler there on Sunday with cloudy skies and with a few rain chances continuing, especially the further south you go. 10 day forecast. Uh, ironically, Sunday is the first day of fall and uh, it's basically the division of the hot temperatures from the cooler temperatures. We'll keep the 70s throughout next week as high pressure settles in. That's going to give us plenty of sunshine throughout the work week.